Here we are, lastly to talk about um, establishing a culture of customer-centric uh, excellence. Um, if we have all of the ingredients, including um, a constancy of purpose, if we have the ability to create a, an exciting roadmap by defining excellence in its true meaning, if we devel develop the capability um, of um, driving excellence um, by harnessing all of the potential available to us, if we have the right dashboard and the dials for measuring that uh, the drive for excellence does impact in the way we desire, and if we inject a closed loop learning momentum through innovation and uh, recording the knowledge residue from experimentation and from application, uh, we are well on our way to redefining a culture of excellence. So what does that mean? It means that um, everyone in the organization believes that uh, excellence is a good thing. It also means that everybody knows that excellence works. It is not slogan, it is not jargon, uh, and it is not wishful thinking. It is a living thing that people are exposed to every day in their working lives. It also means that our stakeholders and those who impact on us in a variety of ways also get exposed to uh, our language, which is a language of um, a drive for excellence, a passion for excellence, and a determination to impact positively with excellence. So the culture of um, uh, customer-centric excellence is an outcome from doing all of the other building blocks it cannot be managed uh, up front, it has to be arrived at. It is something that will take time and it is something that is heavily dependent on uh, the uh, presence, first and foremost, of a constancy of purpose. It is perhaps what I call the penultimate legacy that good leaders, effective leaders, leave behind them. And we see it in many organizations around the world who have injected the quality ethos during their reigns, but who left it behind and who left it safely in the hands of their successors. Organizations such as General Electric, uh, organizations such as 3M, organizations such as Xerox, organizations such as IBM. They are just amongst the very few organizations that have uh, created that culture of excellence. So we can continue to learn uh, from them. And I now leave you with some clips and some key messages from leaders in Europe who are busy driving excellence and making it impact in their organizations, but leaders who believe in the importance of having a constancy of purpose. We at Henkel are active in three businesses, detergents and household cleaners, toiletries and cosmetics, and adhesives, sealants and surface treatments. What we are striving for is outstanding product quality and customer intimacy. Wherever we produce our products and market our products, it is with the quality of Henkel. We all know that we can only reach our targets by having an integrated management system. What is important we are ready to adjust our management system to any changes in our environment and that is done proactively. You can have lengthy discussion about what quality is, but at the end of the day the only decisive factor for quality is the customer. The customer will decide whether he is satisfied or not, whether he comes back as a customer or he goes to the competition. In order to make sure that this is understood, yes, you have to create an awareness amongst the managers that the customer decides. But as well, you need management techniques. Management techniques like total quality management, EFQM, etc which is vital for maintaining a certain degree of discipline and measure success.
Our industry, the chip industry, is extremely dynamic. Every year we develop new technologies and new products which are leading edge. The market is very volatile. Between 50% growth and 30% shrinking, everything is possible. The industry itself consolidates. That means less and less but stronger players playing a dominant role. To be successful in this tough environment, you have to focus on leadership culture. The way how you integrate your customers, the way how you treat these issues, the way how you treat your employees is the most decisive factor. We at Infineon believe in leadership excellence and we want to make it the most successful business element for the future.